Welcome back. Thank you for staying with us. This is still Why in the Morning. And in case you're just joining us, you are on time for the first conversation of the day. And we are talking about matters health, specifically um, on uh, st uh, st standing against failure. Sorry. And for that, we are joined by an expert. He is a counselor, a psychologist, and a trainer. That is Emilio Murioki. Yeah. Uh, Karibu sana. Asante sana. Glad to have you with us. Thank you. Thank you for having me. All right. So we want to talk about failure because um, in this current time, people mm -hmm. have done the KCSE. Uh, they feel like they have failed. Some have failed, you know, and there's all that pressure around you. And, uh, you know, sometimes failure is stigmatized. Yeah, failure. Failure is, 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 a, is a, you know, when you say failure, mm -hmm. um, if you ask someone, uh, if you tell someone that they have failed, some, one, one thing they they will start by is uh, they feel as if you put them down. So um, how to uh, um, to fight against failure? Ni kitu ambacho tunafaa kusoma na kulan na kujua bila ambavu tutaweza kupikana na na failure ikikuja ama wakati mbado unani kama ukaribu kufail. Okay. We fail in many instances. Mm -hmm. For instance, uh, um, in relationships, Sometimes we can encounter failures in relationship when um, uh, something that you expected in a, in a relationship does, does not work out. Mm -hmm. Number one, number two, we can even fail um, in exams, maybe education. We can talk of failure in, in education and also even in career as as youth. Maybe the career that you would like to to do yeah. is not the one that you. You, you've been able to uh, to go through. Mm -hmm. yeah. So failure can come in different shapes and forms. Yeah. Okay, Nasasa, what does failure do to, to someone if not, uh, you know, taken in the right way? Well, um, once, um, once you're not able to understand, you know, failure uh, comes in two ways. Mm -hmm. and it can come from yourself or from others. So if failure is, a, is, a, is from um, others, uh, for instance, it's even worse. What because do you mean by failure from others? From if other people feel um, that you failed, it is even worse than when you, you are fail. the one who understand that you failed. Mm. Take for instance, uh, in an exam, for example, in an exam like KCSE, mm -hmm. you know, the, a person who is sitting for a KCSE is the same person who has been sitting for other exams, uh, for instance. Yeah? yeah. But all these exams that they have been doing, they do not have a problem with them. But because this KCSE, for, for example, is, a, is, a, is watched. There are so many people that are expecting maybe a result from them. Mm -hmm. If they fail in such, mm -hmm. they feel so demeaned because of the expectation that um, other people expect from, uh, from this particular person. Okay. Yeah, so if, it's, if, you've, if, you, um, if you're the one who understands that, if it is within you, if it's, um, is, for example, you're failing an, an instance where it's only you that knows that you failed, the impact will not be as worse as when um, it, 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 people, um, around you. people around you expect maybe mm -hmm. uh, something from you. Right. So therefore, it all depends with what, um, what, you, what you expect and what you expect other people are expecting from you. Mm -hmm. yeah. So how, what, what does it do to, to, to someone knowing that people, you know, uh, people see you as a failure or people... There's one thing, people knowing that you have failed mm -hmm. and people seeing you as a failure. Are those two different things? Yeah. Um, people knowing that you're... A failure. You know, you, it's you, like you are an identity that you have. So this one is just a failure. But uh, people knowing that you have failed, maybe it's just an exam that you have failed one time. You know, it all depends with how you take it as a person. Uh, did you ex do you have the mm. expectation that, um, you know, did you give the expectations to others that, uh, that, that were not met? Take, for instance, um, if, um, if you, are, um, you expect maybe to, uh, to get a certain grant and you've promised many people that this is where I, I, I want to reach, yeah? Mm -hmm. and, uh, and, 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 um, and you've not get, got, gotten there. And uh, um, when, 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 when you, you've not told anybody, then they, they, they're surprised with your grades. Those are two different things. There is the way that you, you, you react if a person knows, um, has an expectation for you, you know, uh, and there is, um, um, th there's a difference. Mm. There's a totally a difference between, between the two okay. that you've asked about. And that how, you know, how should one deal with it so that it doesn't affect their mental health? Well, uh, how to deal with it, number one, you are, you are supposed to, uh, to be ready 
for two things anytime you you're taking an event mm -hmm. you're supposed to be ready for um, um, for success and failure because um, an outcome you, uh, anything you do there, there must be an outcome mm. right anything you do there must be an outcome which is the um, um, uh, the, the success and the failure so therefore you must be ready you must be ready whether you're going to fail what will you take the failure when you when you fail how do you take the success when you do so it has to come before before even you do uh, whatever that you want to do okay yeah but they say you know failure what okay what is failure really because they say failure is when you is failing so many times and rising up again failure is when you um when you are not be able to achieve your goals mm -hmm. that is the meaning of failure. that is the that is the dictionary meaning of it. Yeah. But now, you know, what people say, just, I think maybe probably to encourage others uh -huh. because failure is part of life. Or uh -huh. if, do, you, do you agree with that? Because they say failure is part of life. So you need to know uh, that you're going to fail at some point, but you need to rise up. And that is what makes success. Failing, failing so many times, but rising up again. Uh, failure is part of life. And uh, it's normal. It's normal for someone to fail. It, it's okay, you know. Uh, it's normal for someone to maybe not to achieve Mm -hmm. whatever they feel that they, they should have achieved it's it's normal okay so if um and you know the failure is uh, just like i said in the beginning is defined by the person uh, an individual mm -hmm. you're the one who defines what failure is sometimes um uh, people think that you um, sometimes you may other people may feel as if you failed but you've not failed take for example um if you're working in an in a, an environment which is not very conducive and yeah. then you achieve your goal according to how you feel it. But maybe your boss is saying, Bado ujafika kiwango kile ambacho tulikuwa tunaitaji. So maybe boss yako anafikiria umeanguka. Lakini you yourself, you know, give, given the, the circumstances of what, how you did your job, you mm -hmm. did it with all that, what, all that you had. So therefore, the failure is, um, um, you should understand it as, a, you know, personally. Sangine ni vizuri ujue mimi kama mimi nimefanya aje. Before mm. other people come in, yes, before, yes. Before, mm. before other people come in and tell you that you did wrong here, it is very important that first of all, you understand what, what have you done. Have you done it rightly? Before another person tells you that wewe bado ujafika kiwango ambacho tulikuwa tunaitaji ufike, wewe kwanza unafaa kujuriza, mimi nimefika wapi, nimefanya nini, what have I done? What about uh, if it's the other way around, you think you have failed, but others think that it's actually, you've done good? Um... That, that you know, it, 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 it depends on, on, on how, um, when, a, when, when another person feels that you've done it well and, um, and, 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 and you, you feel, mm, you feel like the, I think that's why now we are supposed to, to, uh, to appreciate the, the use of the, 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 the feedbacks. Mm -hmm. You know, other people telling you what you've, you've done. Vizuri kwanza ujue mtu mwingine anakuambia. The feedback that you get from other people. Okay. It's very, very important. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because um, um, we, 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 we live all to, tunaishi, mahari, tunaishi pamoja na we are supposed to support. Iyo ambavo mwenza kwa mekuambia mm -hmm. kwa mba ume, um, ume, ume, umefanya vipi. Ni, ni muhimu sana kujua kujia assess. Ndi ujue what you do next. Okay. Yeah. So, okay. So now, how do you stand against failure? That is our main topic today. How to stand against failure? Yeah, um, how do we stand against failure? Number one, mm -hmm. we need to uh, to understand our, where we stand. Where, uko, uko, um, what is umefanya na umefiki, umefikia kiwango kani kama ni failure? I said there, the, in, in as youth, we may face different uh, uh, scenarios which we uh, which we may fail. Kuna zile vitu ambazo tunaiza fail kwazo. Number one, in a relationship. Yeah. So uh, we need to understand what a relationship is. We need to understand what, you know, uh, if, if we fail in a relationship, the reason why we fail in relationships yeah. is because, number one, what wengine tunafikilia kwamba relationship inafaa ku reciprocate. Vili ambavo umefanyia mwenzako, ndiyo pia nafaa kukufanyia. Mm -hmm. Sawa, sawa. Like, like um, relationship is not, aikuangi, it's not very, very, atu, um, what you expect from other, another person is what is going to get, what you do to another person is what is going to get back to you. Mm -hmm. Sawa, sawa. Yeah. Like for example, kinuria mtu gari, ni kitu gani ambacho chamana sana utafanya ambacho kita, kita kuwa um, chamana kama hilo gari ambacho wamekununulia. Mm -hmm. Unanielewa? Yeah. So sangini kama hata mtu wamekupatia kitu, ku, ume, 
we, we should give our best, mm -hmm. not our all. Our you know, best, not our, our best all. and not our all. That is what we are supposed to do in any circumstances, in our careers, in our education, and also in our, in our, um, even in our relationships. So, uh, okay, I, I, I'm a bit confused. Giving our best and not our all. So, isn't our best our all? No, hmm. no. Your best is not your all. So what, what is your all and what is your best? You know, your best is, uh, is what you have to know the limits, hmm. the limit to which you can go. You need to understand yourself and know that this is up and in Bali, Kwangu. Like, for example, if you, um, if you, you know, the unajua ile chakula ukienda kwa hoteli unaweza ukakula, mm -hmm. kiwango gani ambacho unaweza kula. You know very well that uh, ukienda kwa hoteli fulani, for instance, um, wale ambao ni wa, um, tese asoras, unaweza, utaenda, kuna wale, uh, maybe a youth mwenye anza maisha, utaenda kukula kwa hoteli ambayo inauza chakula elufu kama kumi. <laughs> no problem. Unaona? Not. That is your, that is, therefore you know your best. You know the best that you can give yourself. And therefore, there are those that utter the, the entire salary that you have, wanapeana yote. Mm -hmm. That is the all. That is the difference between giving your best and your all. So, so in, any, in any circumstances, I think it's very important that we give our, our best. Mm -hmm. Our best. Not giving the all. The all that we have. Yeah. We give our best and not our all. And therefore, if you understand what is your best and what is your all, therefore, you'll be able to, um, to reach a point where you know Mm -hmm. Now this is this is this is beyond me. Yeah. This is beyond me. So therefore, I mm -hmm. what I what I should do now for, at this at this juncture. Therefore, I should um, I should I should set a limit. I should set a limit. Therefore, for example, if it um, is a performance, yeah. if it's it's a it, if it kama ni kazini unajua mm -hmm. unajua I am supposed to uh, to to do my best at work. I'm supposed to do my best. But sometimes uh, sometimes we are required to give our all. But you need to, to, to understand when, when the limit will come. You need to know where to draw the line. Yeah, you need to know where uh, to draw the line. Okay. Mm. How, how else can you stand against failure? Is there a way to prevent failure? Yeah. Mm, it, it, um, it, we know, number one is you understand yourself. Mm -hmm. You know, there are ways in which you need to prevent failure. The way that to, pre to prevent failure is, uh, is understanding yourself better. Self-awareness. Mm -hmm. Someone is supposed to be self-aware. And um, by this, I mean, um, uh, let's say, for example, um, let's say, for example, um, if you if you give a, 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 an, an example of, um, uh, let's say, um, in a school, mm -hmm. in a school, yeah. uh, um, one, one teacher told me that uh, if you have, if you are in a class, uh, um, if you have, uh, let's say, for example, you are doing 10 subjects in a, in a school and you pass in each and every subject, upita kwa kila subject, eh? utaku umepita kama we, kama the, mm -hmm. the entire you, sindio? Yeah. Ukipita, uki, uki major na subject moja, for example, uki major na ili subject moja, ukifanya mini grade, eh, maybe ili ambayo umeanguka sana itakuwa, itakuwa, itakupeleka chini. Unanielewa? Yeah. So, um, very important. Tunafaa kujua, kujua mali what we can do best mm -hmm. na hili ambayo watuwezi tukafanya to our best. That is very, very important. Ni vizuri tujue hii naweza nikafika mm -hmm. wapi kiwango gani hingi naweza kufika kiwango gani. Mm -hmm. Kwa sababu um, when we, what we need to understand is that um, the, the world does not revolve around us. That we have to succeed always. That lazima, lazima uh, lazima mm -hmm. matukio ambayo na Yes. So, like for instance, if uh, uh, what I learned in in um, Jankorov is something to go by, um, the, the world revolves in Azunguka. Lakini like ukisima mali ambapo uko utarimeni there mm -hmm. for so long. So, ile, ku, ile usemi tunasemanga kuwoga na kuenda soko, sometimes I think it's very important when it, when, when it comes to failure. Okay. Unamariza una sa hiyo hiyo, alafu unaanza ku unarudi ku maybe kujitayarisha tena kujua venye utafanya because what, be you need, what we need to what, what we need to get from a failure is not what, that we have failed but what is the lesson that you've learned from that failure okay hmm. so take the lesson from the you failure. take the lesson from the failure what what is most important from the failure mm. is not that we failed 
but what is the lesson? What do you do next? Mm -hmm. After now you've seen that you did not succeed in the goals that you had. Wow, yeah. amazing, okay. So now <laughs> giving a practical example of what is, um, someone is going through mm -hmm. uh, currently at the moment, someone uh, was expecting to get maybe a B plus and mm -hmm. they ended up getting a C mm -hmm. in the exam or maybe a C minor because to them that is failure. Mm -hmm. So how should they handle that situation? How should the parents uh, handle that situation? Number one, um, number one for the parents, mm -hmm. they, they should not uh, start by condemning the, 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 the person, yeah. maybe the student for mm -hmm. instance. Mm -hmm. uh, because um, sometimes, uh, um, sometimes people uh, base failure Mm -hmm. People people view failure based on themselves, mm -hmm. and they they are not able to understand that person that they view have failed, what circumstances they were in. Yeah. Sawa sawa. So maybe mm -hmm. a parent somewhere could be uh, maybe thinking that because I passed in the KCSE, mm -hmm. I don't expect my child to not to get the grade that I got. Yeah. Because I I passed. So therefore, this is a this is like it is a genetic, uh, mm -hmm. it, it's, it's like you, you, you think um, for, uh, because you, you, you did well or because you did not do well, mm -hmm. you expect that uh, what, um, what the, the next person is going to do is, is supposed to be better than you. So therefore, the, the, child should, the, the, the parents are supposed to understand the child, the child and maybe try to, to ask them, are you okay with it? With the grant that you have mm -hmm. because that is a question that many of them will not ask are you okay with the grant that you have if you have for instance um, a b plus and as a parent i expect that you're supposed to head to to have gotten a, a. A, an a are you okay are you okay what what can i help you? how can i help you mm -hmm. rather than condemning this this same this same uh, this same uh, student rather than condemn you know uh, being uh, personal, and you know, um, replace, uh, displacing, mm -hmm. you know, the anger to this person. Okay. Sometimes, even some of the parents that, we, that, we, that, that some of our parents may not be um, harsh on us because of the grant. It could be something that is from a, another another event. Maybe someone is um, is angry because of the uh, maybe the the, the 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 other the partner, and therefore because the child has failed the event there. They project the stress, it to the they child. project the, the mm. stress to, to the child. Okay. So most importantly is to know whether the child or the student, the student is okay with the grades that they had. Okay. If you if you know, then you can ask them how can we help you with those grades. Mm -hmm. Because remember, if this student got a grade that they did not they did not um, mm -hmm. view the, the it's it's the, it's theirs. You know they they feel they failed, and then you um, uh, you try to maybe um, uh, to go um, to see them in a, in a negative way, this will affect them like double. Okay. This will be a double. It's a quite tragedy, Marambili. Mm -hmm. yeah. What about that, uh, that student who feels that they failed? What, what would you tell them? Well, uh, those that feel they failed. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, um, if you feel like you failed, uh, one thing you should understand is, uh, is uh, where I, where, you know, mutu wanasema ameanguka, sometimes it's very important to angalie nyuma yako pia. Because you could be having some people who are looking upon you. Yeah. Kuna wale watu ambao wanasema, mwini wanasema ameanguka, lakini I wish it's me that hand this grant that he, he, he is saying. Mm -hmm. So if you feel like you failed, you should not remain at that point of failing. It is, I think this is the high time that you're supposed now to start asking myself, what next? Mm -hmm. What next? Because if you fail, if you, if, you, if you say that I failed today, tomorrow mm -hmm. you say I failed, the next day I failed, mm -hmm. where will, until when will you be, uh, will you be saying that I, I have failed? And when, what is the next thing that you're supposed to do? I'll give you a, a very live example of a person that, um, that, 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 that was in a, in a college, in a university, and uh, he, he performed, um, he got a grade, um, he did not get the grade, he, he expected to get maybe a first class honor or maybe second class upper. Yeah. But unfortunately, uh, his performance was not that well. He got um, a second class lower. 
lower division. Mm -hmm. So after getting the second class lower division, what he thought is that um, I, this grade, you know, in his mind, this grade will not give me a job. This grade is not going to give me a job. Mm -hmm. So I will remain here for the rest of my life without getting a job. So what do I do to myself? Should I remain? Should I now go back to school and do another course? No. So he thought, because I have done this course, let me mm -hmm. try as a volunteer. Yeah. Let me start as a volunteer. Maybe on the way, someone will find me, it will find me and, and help me further. And therefore, that is how it began. And from that point, experience started coming in, coming in. And, and it was so much experienced. This is not the same as the person who handled second class, uh, maybe um, or a first okay. class, and, and waited at home. Mm -hmm. So where do you, where do you, what do you do after you realize that you've, this is not, you, this is not the, the thing that you have not achieved? what you wanted to achieve, what do you do after that? Okay. When you realize that this is not what I, this, this is, this is uh, below what I wanted to achieve, what do you do after that? You should now uh, rearrange yourself. You should rearrange yourself and, and know what is the next step. Because mm -hmm. you're not supposed to remain at the same point forever. Okay. Yeah. So basically, you have Woge Rudisoko. Woge Rudisoko. Okay. Mm -hmm. And now, wh what is the place uh, of expectation? Because most Australia comes a as a result of expectation. Mm -hmm. You know, you're expecting to get this grade. You're expecting to marry this person. Mm -hmm. You're expecting to get this much money. But when you get this particular age, so what is the place of, is it okay to have expectations or should you limit your expectations? It's, it's fine. It's fine to have expectations. Mm -hmm. And um, um, it's, it's, it's okay. It's okay to have expectations and to expect. Actually, it's normal. You know, it's, it's, um, it's just like the way we say stress is, uh, stress are very, very important mm. in life because um, uh, if, we were, if I was not stressed of how I look in the studio, for instance, come away. So stress is very, very important. Okay. And, uh, and the same as the, the expectations, is they are very, very important because they, uh, they help you, you know, have a target and know where you want to reach the next time. Mm -hmm. If you don't have an, an, an expectation, you just remain there. You remain there. Okay. So, so, but once you 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 yeah, you try to maybe to achieve the goal that you have, mm -hmm. um, that is where now I'm saying, most importantly is to uh, the, the 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 you come out of that yeah. uh, experience with a lesson. If failure comes in, but if you succeed, well and good. Okay. Yeah. Amazing. And now finally, uh, as we come to a conclusion on this, um, what what. When is it right for you to to say that maybe enough is enough, maybe I need to step down? You know, recently we had the UK Prime Minister stepping down and mm -hmm. people may see that as failure because, mm -hmm. or you might think sometimes letting go is, you know, giving up is failing, but mm -hmm. sometimes maybe that is what is needed. What is your uh, say on that? Um, you know, um, um, when, when, well, when doing something, it's very important you you know uh, what will 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 come out, uh, out of it. Mm -hmm. uh, will uh, maybe the person that is close to you be comfortable mm -hmm. with what you've done? Will your parents be comfortable? Will will uh, maybe the the friends be comfortable? And therefore, how will you be? How will you take this um, um, if they are not comfortable? How okay. will you take it if they are not comfortable? So I think. Um, in, if you st if you decide to step to, to step uh, to, to step down, mm -hmm. uh, you you should consider how you will take the um, uh, the event mm -hmm. in the event that the other people are negative about it. Okay. You should be prepared for for both the positive and the and the oh, negative the outcomes. Yeah, okay. the reactions. So wow. preparation is very very important. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow, amazing. Um, maybe to conclude, what would you say is key to standing against failure from all that you've said? Maybe you can give a summary. What is key to standing against failure? Uh, what is key uh, in, um, in, 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 in standing against failure, number one, is um, understanding yourself. Mm -hmm. Yeah, self-understanding or self-awareness. Being self-aware. Number two is self-confidence. Mm -hmm. Be confident in whatever that you've done. Uh, don't always think that... Um, I, you you did not do your best. Be confident in what uh, uh, mm -hmm. you've done. 
you know, okay. and number three is also silver appreciation. Mm -hmm. Because in many, many cases, we wait for other people to, uh, to tell us that we've done good. But it is very, it's good if you, you do it yourself, you appreciate yourself mm -hmm. first. Before another person tells you that maybe this, this was not what I expected from you, yeah? Yeah. So appreciate yourself, at least. You know, like for instance, let me give you an example. If you are called for a job interview, for instance, and um, let's say you are, you are a psychologist like me. There are so many people that have done um, and maybe a course that I have mm -hmm. uh, in, th in this country, for instance. And therefore, if I am one among maybe 100 people that have, co have been um, uh, shortlisted, that means it's, a, it's an achievement by itself. So you start from there. Know that I've already achieved to get mm -hmm. here. Before you start now, you know, condemning yourself that I, after I went to that interview, the, the, the results were not as I expected. Yeah. So achievement should be appreciated. Yeah. And uh, the best appreciation is self-appreciation. Before you wait for, you know, another person to um, uh, appreciate you. Because you may live your life uh, entirely waiting for someone to appreciate, to tell you th you've done it, you've done well. And then you, you, you find out that number, nobody is doing that. So if you appreciate yourself over mm -hmm. and o over and over again, once in a while you keep on uh, you know, appreciating yourself, um, you, you feel good, you feel nice. Okay, Yeah. wow, amazing. Thank you very much, Emilio. Where can people get you on your social media if they want to reach out to you? And that is your camera. Mm, can I give up my, my phone number? You Maybe the WhatsApp phone number. If uh, you feel you're free, uh, then you can. My, my number is 0707 956 07 07 225 uh, On Facebook, I, um, I have a page uh, mm -hmm. uh, which is called Mind Minds. We need to mind minds. Very important. We mind, mind, we mind, mind minds. Mind minds because we mind businesses. Mm. You know, mind your business. Sometimes it's a saying that is very common, yeah. but do we mind our minds? Okay. It's very important that people uh, as well mind minds. That okay. is minding your mind and minding the other people's mind, the other pe others' minds. Oh, so yeah. protecting your mental health and yeah. that of others mm. too. Yeah. Wow, amazing. Thank you very much, Emilio, uh, for coming uh, on board pleasure. and sharing with us this amazing insight. Thank you. All right, so that has been Emilio Morioki, a trainer, a counselor, and a psychologist uh, talking to us about how to stand against failure. I hope you have taken something from that. And now we are going to take a short break, but we'll be back with more on matters entrepreneurship. So stick with us, talk to us at Y254 channel across all social platforms using the hashtag Y in the morning.